Hi guys, so this is going to be a review for the um, Clarisonic Mia 2. And this is just the model that I have, which is kind of like a cobalt blue. Um, I purchased this about two months ago, two and a half months ago. Um, I purchased it at Ulta, which now, you know, I know that it's sold at Sephora and Ulta. And the reason I just purchased it at Ulta was because I had some points that I needed to redeem and it was like, I don't know, I got like $10 off, I believe. This does retail for $150. Um, the reason that I got the Mia 2 versus just the regular Clarisonic Mia, um, which I believe retails for, it's like $99, it's $100, it's like $50 more for the Mia 2, um, was simply for, the only difference is the two speeds, which at first I was not too concerned about that part. And now that I have the Mia 2, I'm glad I did get the Mia 2 versus the Mia 1 because um, I can feel the difference once you're washing your face. Um, the first, I would say, week or two, I did just do the first um, the first speed to kind of get my skin used to it because I didn't know how it was going to react because um, I had never, I had used a device like this before in the past. Um, but it was one of the ones that are sold your typical drugstore, which the brushes go all the way around. And this one, um, I don't know if you're gonna be able to tell on camera, but only the middle part is basically the one that's kind of rotating. And it doesn't rotate like 100%, like a 360, it doesn't rotate all the way around. It just kind of does this basically. Um, which I thought it was a little strange because I was used to the other type of brush. But once you, you know, read the instructions, it kind of makes sense. Um, and like I said, I just got the cobalt blue. I just thought it was a really cute color. I was going to go with the lavender because purple is my favorite color. And the other thing is when you turn it on and that's first speed and that, that's the second speed. And then I'll let it kind of do its thing for a second. And you're going to be able to hear the little beep. Let's see if you'll do it. Um, did you hear that? That's basically you, I, I just do like say one side of my face. And then when, when, when that sound goes off, then I do the other side and so forth. I do my nose, my forehead, my chin, each side of, you know, my cheeks you know and you know just all my face and I even take it down underneath because lately well not lately but when I do break out I seem to break break out like around my jawline um and I do suffer from blackheads and that sort of thing so it says to do I guess in a minute you know your whole face is clean um I just kind of go and once I feel like my skin is, my face is clean, then I stop. Um, now, I don't do this right away at the sink. What I do is I, you know, I use one of my Aveeno uh, makeup removing um, cloths and then I take, now it did come, let me just tell you probably right off the back, I should have told you what it comes with. Obviously, the Clarisonic itself. And then it comes with a little travel case, which I don't use because I don't travel. Um, and I don't even keep it on this, like when I have it in my drawer. And then it came with the Clarisonic Refreshing Gel Cleanser, um, which I talked in a previous video that I did not like. Um, I'm glad I got to test it out in a little travel size because I was thinking about getting the full size because I had heard somebody in another video um, talk about it and said that they liked it. Um, and although it says foaming, gel purifies and brightens. I didn't think it was that foaming at all. Um, I am trying to use it up. There's a little bit left just to use it up. I don't like to be wasteful, but I will not be repurchasing. What I do use instead of that um, is the St. Ives Blemish Control Green Tea Gel Cleanser. I just put a little bit on the back of my hand and I just kind of work, you know, once I get a little bit wet, I, you know, grab a little bit off the back of my hand and I just start working and obviously this does foam up and I really do like it 
Um, it's oil-free salicylic acid acne medication, 100% natural extract, extracts, and it's paraben-free and dermatologist um, tested. So this is what I've been using as of lately, and I, I like how it works. And then it comes obviously with the um, with the charger, which this part just kind of kind of just magnetic, um, and I charge it. And then, like I said, it does come with a little travel, um, little plasticky thing to store it at, I guess. If you're going to be traveling, I don't travel, so you could use it that way. What I do, and I just find it more comfortable just myself talking, is I just store it in a little makeup case that I'm not using for makeup. And I just store there the actual Clarisonic in my cord. And... I just keep this in my drawer with all of my other stuff. Um, so far, I like it. It did take me a while. I've been watching YouTube for probably two years now. Um, it did take me a while to purchase just because I thought anywhere from $100 to $150 for a face cleansing device was a little much. And I thought it was just kind of a hype. Um, because this was included in like Oprah's favorite things a while back. And I think everybody and their mother here on YouTube owns one. And at first I thought it was just a hype, um, just like any other beauty product, makeup. Um, but now I can definitely testify that it does work. Um, I noticed my skin breaking out a lot less. Now I can say it did break out a tiny bit within like the first couple of weeks after using which I was expecting because a lot of the people that I had heard reviews on or you know watch reviews here on YouTube they had mentioned basically like your skin's purging all that junk and dirt off out of your pores because it's you know like a deep cleanser device so I did expect that right off the back so just kind of be fair warned um, if that happens, don't return it. Don't think this is garbage. This does not work because once you get surpassed that and your skin's actually getting rid of all that junk, whatever you are putting in your skin after that, like treatments or even acne treatments, I notice they are working a lot better than they were working prior to the um, Clarisonic. So just keep with it don't get disappointed after like a week or two if you do get um breakouts i mean everybody's different everybody's skin type is different but my skin is sensitive acne prone skin and like i said i did break out a little bit within a couple of weeks after using it but don't be discouraged just keep using it at first i was using it maybe twice maybe three times a week and now I use it every day. And like I said, I don't do this first step. I do use a makeup removing cloth. And then I go to the sink and use this. And I can say it was the best $150 I could ever spend. Because as we all know, we spend probably a lot more at the drugstore trying this and that. And beauty products and acne products and anti-aging products and if you think they're not working you should maybe give this a try because it's probably your skin's just clogged up with all that other junk and makeup and things that we put on our skin to make it look clearer but they're actually it's not the products that are not working it's just that maybe your skin needs a little deep cleaning and this will do the trick believe me so now i'm a you know, I'm a fair believer that this does work and it is worth $150. So that is my little review. If you guys have any questions, just put them in the bar below and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.